Good evening, we're back with more Marvel Snap. Beginning the evening at rank 83 and 1 cube. Fell from 91 all the way down to 83. It climbed up to 91, mostly on luck. I suspected at the time it was luck with the Lockjaw Gamble deck, and then I fell back down to 87 or so and dropped further, testing out different decks. I'll be playing Miracle Sarah tonight. I don't really have the cards to make any of the top meta decks. I'm missing Shuri, missing Taskmaster. Missing Red Skull, missing Dracula, Ghost Rider. So some important pieces there are missing. So we'll turn to a control deck. I climbed to infinite last month with a control deck. A Zabu control deck then. And this will be a District X game. Everybody loves District X. Normally I would save Mysterio for Bishop, but I have District X, so I probably won't even draw Bishop. It's probably not in the deck. Could have played Zabu there, probably should have. Now I'll just play White Queen. See what the opponent's got. Hella, okay. I don't want Doctor Strange to move anything, that's why I'm playing him to District X. actually kind of wish my Mysterio clone had gotten destroyed and had not gone to District X because then I could Enchantress's Blue Marvel and Power Stone. I mean, I know I can win one lane, I just have no way of winning the second one. Seeing a lot of Lockjaw decks due to this featured location quantum tunnel. A lot of Lockjaw, a lot of ramp. Usually don't play the Nova on turn one. That's interesting to Rickety Bridge. Play Sentinel here. Scarlet Witch can win the rickety bridge later. Would love to draw Bishop here so I could then play Mysterio and buff Bishop. Here's Bishop. Don't want to swap it out. I saw this deck on Reddit with Quake in it, and I thought it was interesting for location tech in this Sarah Miracle deck, so I thought I'd try it out. Hopefully this clone gets swapped out for Sarah, but we'll see. Quake? Okay. Oh, 
Well, we'll see what we can do about pulling Sarah here. Two shots at it. There's three cards left in the deck. If one of them is Killmonger, I do want the Nova destroyed. There's Sarah. Great. And Enchantress immediately eliminates her ability. So Leech destroys my Scarlet Witch plan. But I can go ahead and move Sarah. Then play a okay. Killmonger is the last card in the deck, so I could play Sentinel to bring out Killmonger and pop the Nova. I've played this deck a little bit and I like it. I think it's capable of climbing. Do I want to swap out Nova for something here? I think everything that I could pull would be better than Nova in this particular situation, except for Killmonger, but that's a 1 in 7. Well, actually I don't think Enchantress is better either. Angela, Zabu, Scarlet Witch, Sentinel, so 2 in 7. Let's do it. Okay, Angela's fine. My opponent is playing a Lockjaw deck. I'll play Mysterio over Quake here. I don't know what the right location is yet. Giganto. Those card Giganto doesn't matter because I have Shang-Chi. Bishop's a good pull. The Mysterio play didn't proc Angela. I did play a card there. So it Swaps it with a card in the deck before proccing Angela. That's interesting. I didn't know that. So now I'll use a little Quake to... Okay, my opponent wasn't going to play anything else to go on them total. That's fine. Scarlet Witch will change it. That's an excellent draw from the Scarlet Witch. And now Shang-Chi deletes his Nidavalier stuff. So just go Zabu here. I think it's going to be Shang-Chi and Killmonger. Ultimately, to Nidavalier to win the game. Well, actually, not Killmonger because popping the Nova. Popping the Nova is bad because I have seven power at bar with no name at the moment, and I would go up to nine if I pop the Nova, which would tie me there, so. Next turn, we'll Shang-Chi and Sentinel to Nidavalier.
think Ghost would be pretty good in this deck, the new card. Well, my opponent didn't believe that I have the Shang-Chi. I'm going to pay the price. Scarlet Witch wins games a surprising amount of the time in this deck, especially paired with Quake, because you can swap the locations around if you get one you don't like with her. Good pull for my opponent. Well, I'll have to draw the Scarlet Witch or Quake in order to win Luke's bar. Chantress would be a good draw here as well. <laughs> okay. So we have to rely on luck in this one. Not too worried about winning Luke's bar. So I would like to get Enchantress or... Which of these is the clone? Are they all the real Mysterio now? Or how do I know which one is the clone once they're in my hand? I have no idea. Swap the clones out. Okay, how do I win this? I play Enchantress to Luke's bar and kill Monger. Drops by two, three, power, and then I buff everything by three. That should do it. Is there any way my opponent calls a snap? I mean, a lot of a lot of stuff could ha happen here with. Quantum Tunnel being on the right. Let's just go to Showdown here. Okay, he's got Ultron. That doesn't matter because I have Killmonger, so I should have snapped. He probably would have called. Yeah, I should have snapped.
I actually forgot about the Patriot buffing Blue Marvel after the Enchantress. Once he has no ability, he gets the Patriot buff. So, whoops. Good thing I didn't snap. Missed that little detail. We get out Zabu first. I go for a lane swap here. Got Killmonger to deal with that. I can get rid of the hood from my side as well. So we go Scarlet Witch. Nova. Killmonger. Enchantress. Bad ordering. Seven, eight, nine, ten. That's thirteen power quantum tunnel. I think that's good enough for a snap with the vault win. Pressuring Crimson Cosmos as well. Adding power there, so. Okay, that's fine. Play Zabu first. I'll get out the Nova. Get rid of the Quantum Tunnel.
interesting. Oh, gonna get a lot of vibraniums. What's better at this point, Bishop or Sentinel? I think they're roughly equal. Killmonger would be a very good draw, but it's a 1 in 10. Who makes a big Captain Marvel? Alright, we'll just go ahead and play Shang-Chi and a Vibranium and hope for the best. Nope, still lost. Oh wait, didn't lose, I forgot about Mysterio. <laughs> well, should I have snapped? What could my opponent have played that would have won there? I mean, any big card to Dream Dimension, that's why I didn't snap. I didn't figure he'd play like a, well, no, a big card would have gotten killed by... No, I had initiative, so any a big card to Dream Dimension would have won, which is... So, not snapping is fine, I think. I didn't figure he would do that, because he already had a big card there. Figured you would Taskmaster. Okay, let's get rid of the Quantum Tunnel. And I may actually quake next turn to see if I could uh, trick my opponent into destroying something. If I have initiative, which I do not. Let's just play bishop. I'm not scared of the death because uh, I have Shang-Chi in the deck. Okay, now I do want to swap the locations. I'm not playing Mysterio yet because I want Nova to be the first card I destroy. What could I win here? What could I draw here that would win? Do I need to play Mysterio at this point? Would Shang-Chi win? It might. Uh, let's play Mysterio. Zabu. Okay. Okay. 
Shang Chi's not gonna win now. There's too much. Oh, and I don't have a spot for Shang Chi mid. And I played the order wrong, so I didn't destroy Nova. All round failure, but I didn't draw the card I needed anyway. My opponent has too much big stuff on the table with the lockjaw and the death pull, so he's got it. Should have Scarlet Witched the middle location immediately upon seeing it. So a lot of opponents are playing Lockjar ramp decks to take advantage of it. I still don't think I would have won, but I would have given myself a better chance. Wake doesn't do anything here, it's just a 2-3. My opponent gonna play Carnage. Oh, that's a surprise. And that's a gift, means I win mid lane. That makes more sense. All that for one cube. This time we'll get rid of it immediately. Definitely Bishop. Yeah, I think Bishop to Central Park. Yeah, to me! 
Okay, well I know I want to kill Monger. This adds 8 and 6 is 14 power. 15, 16, 17 power. So it'll be at 8, 16, 22, 23, 24, 25. It's not bad. Not going to win Washington, D.C. Can I win Central Park? It depends on what he plays. I don't think this play is that good. Unless my opponent does something stupid with vision, moves him away. I need a Chang Chi to win this one. Same player. That's not good at all. Okay, I mean... It doesn't bother me giving up one cube when something obviously bad like that happens. I try not to snap when something obviously bad happens to my opponent. Because, why? They're only going to continue if it's actually not as bad as it seems. Typically you want to snap on you want to snap when your opponent thinks things are going well, but actually it's going very poorly. I'm going to Scarlet Witch the Dream Dimension so that I can play Sarah on 5. Oh, okay. Probably was looking for Quantum Tunnel and didn't see it. Felt his hand didn't work if he didn't have it. Ah. Uh -huh. Well, I do have Shang Chi. Mbaku. <laughs> Interesting that he would arrow there. So he gets to continue quantum tunneling. And even if I quake, it'll still swap out with Lockjaw. I think I still will quake. Just for the tempo to use the mana.
Interesting. Killmonger comes out early. Well, this game's going very poorly. The arrow on the uh, Scarlet Witch actually looks pretty good for him now. I don't see any way I can win this. There's nothing I can get from my deck. There's just nothing that does anything here. <laughs> this isn't anything unless all he gets is a rock. But he just needs one power at Subterranea, or two power at Quantum Tunnel, I mean, to win. So, uh, yeah, this isn't worth going to Showdown unless he has absolutely nothing. I have initiative here, so I think I'll play Quake. See if I can get my opponent to destroy something he doesn't want to destroy. Nope, but he will get rocks. So will I, sadly. Play the Nova here. I don't have Killmonger, so I don't know that I'll be able to destroy it any other way. Well, so if I play Mysterio, it'll waste the destruction. My opponent doesn't have anything. Would love to draw Killmonger, but it's a one in seven. Well, Shang Chi will deal with Thor, and I have Mysterio. Sentinel, Scarlet Witch. No, no. 
Shang-Chi, Mysterio Scarlet Witch because it eliminates three power from the Jane Foster. There we go. I think I got it. No, do I not? Oh, I do, of course, with the real Mysterio. Fools me every time. Okay, that seems like a good place to end for now. So, good progress. Slow going, but nine cube gain for the evening. And it's very slow going right now due to the random nature of the quantum tunnel. But I'm happy with the progress so far. So, thank you for watching.